top right corner. We are playing K-Mac. We played him a couple times this year, including once in the tournament. Uh, not the single limb, uh, limb portion, but qualifiers. I ended up winning that game. It was a hell game. Really do wish I recorded it. But here we go. This is weekend league. Um, this is all pro, so, you know, I'm not going to be too mad if I get dotted. And I'm sure it's going to be the same way for him. But I do believe he has a Bears theme team, so let's see how this game goes. Yeah, there is a free safety Calvin. I'm currently using him. He's not the best. There are better players. But, um, hey, speaking of him, you know, he can shoot the run. Big frame. He's not going to miss those tackles. Big down right here, guys. If we get the stop, pretty much game, I'd say. Um, but we'll just have to see. Good dot right there. Um, I had to make a choice. He had a curl right there. But I'll take it, you know. Fourth down early. And he's in Bucks playbook. This spread is pretty annoying to stop. Like I said, I did have some success on all Madden. But like we're, we are playing all pro. Good tackle, good drop. Um, maybe could have got an acrobat, but I'll take the drop. What's that, Chargers Nation? Pressure off that right side. Jimmy Graham wide open. Good D. I mean, uh, it was decent D, but good dot, I should say. And I'm just going to start baseline pressing and leaving Fabian Moreau out there. If I get burnt, I get burnt, you know. Maybe we could cheese a stop. Another good dot right there. Roll out corner dot. The thing about spread is, like, he's just calling hike and going, you know. So that could definitely be frustrating at times. Is he using the new Julio, by the way? No, Julio is. That's Roy Williams. Good D right there. He's just going to throw this ball away. He's going to audible down. I don't know really what this is, but he caught me with a quick hike, honestly. And he has someone open. And good dot. See, that's just the thing. Sometimes I should have called the timeout. I always pride myself in calling timeouts when someone, you know, has... I guess he did have an advantage on me because I just did not know what he was going to call if he was going to run. Um, and all my adjustments went across the field, and they were all messed up. But we are on offense now. Um, I don't think I can make this last possession. I really don't want to. I just want to kind of play and have fun. So, you know, whatever happens, happens. Like, obviously, we're going to go for points. Should be able to score. It's all pro. And he is in the 3-3-5 wide. Um, the audible over. Pretty good defense. 4-6, I should say. Right there. Good little move right there. He could have made us drop that. I think he has mid-zone KO on that guy. I believe that was Sean Taylor. But we were just able to kind of maneuver and avoid the tackle. Right here, man. Just going to run a little bit of bench pivot. And he ran match. It's all good. We're going to take our yards and scramble. Should have seen that coming. He loves running match. Trying to hit him up top right here, guys. Hopefully we have time. Uh, but these bombs, it just takes, you know, a while right here bad user we're just gonna take our dump down just gonna hit that guy right there spin get a couple yards once more i believe that was match and is there a new justin reed there might be because i know he's a big justin reed advocate um, i just seen him obviously on the field justin reed is a goon for me i like amos i know they just dropped a new amos i'm kind of nice with amos usually every year whenever he drops i love to play him up top just make some plays it's right here uh, I have everything open, and thankfully we are able to make the read. We rack it. Don't get our feet out of bounds. Uh, I missed the read because I was really looking at the right, the left corner out, but that one right there was just wide open. That I was thankfully able to hit later on in the play. But I'm in a new playbook. I'm in Colts, so it might get tricky in the red zone. That's why you keep yourself a little gimmick. Do I go for two? I'm probably just going to tie this game up. Hopefully we can play a little bit of defense before half, four-minute quarters. It will easily make this the last drive. And I could already tell you right now, he's putting his conservative QB option defense. It's just nice, um, right, Brady? It's just nice to, you know, catch someone off guard. And, you know, when we do, it came for a touchdown. So, 7-7, seven, seven, let's try to get a stop. Well, I'm going to have to move my safeties out a little bit. He knows I'm in cover two, and he could easily split this defense. But, you know, that's a bag right there. And he still threw it, man. Our guy's just not in position. That was a broken play. You know, we're playing good defense. I'll take that. Right here, we're sending the dogs. I like this, this coverage we're in. We could easily well get a mistake. And we had him, but oh my gosh. I got bumped on the running back, man. I had him in a spot that I loved a lot. Um, it is what it is, though, you know. We'll try to get another stop here. We're playing super aggressive right here. I really want to get the ball back before half. You know, the only way we could really do that is if we, if we play aggressive defense. 
It's right here. Was he throwing a pick? I don't have after that. Um, hopefully he was throwing the crosser because I do believe I would have picked that off. I don't know if, what you guys think on that. Great defense. We get a shed. And no, man, why do I use Calvin if he can't get there? Another broken play. It's getting very, very scary for him. Um, that probably right there should have been a stop on my end. And I don't even know. Calvin is just, ooh, ooh, ooh. I don't know if he's the move at user, guys. He is not getting into some things that I thought he'd be able to. Um, that was on my part. Probably a sleepy user as well, but, you know, I don't know how I feel about that. He's going to try to drain some clock right here, and he's able to get yards on that. We got sheds. I don't think that should have been any yards. Right here, he's going back into the, I don't even know what this is. Probably running the ball. I know he passes it again, and he, we get a nice sack. We just sent the heat. Um, like I said, there was something clear as day wide open, but I would happily take what I just got. We were really just playing passive coverage defense, and of course, he has something wide open. I don't know what my hook curl guarded. I thought it could have been that, but you know, those wheel routes are dirty. I should have sent the heat. He's more than likely going to run the ball here. I don't see how he doesn't. Um, there's just no point in passing, but I mean, you never know. You never know. You never know, and he is going to run the ball. And we are not going to be able to stop him. But thankfully, he ran into the end zone. Actually, dove into the end zone. So back-to-back -to -back tough drives, man. Like, those were not easy drives in my book. But, you know, thankfully for me, I do get ball a half. If we get even three right here, I'll feel in a very comfortable position to win the game. 29 seconds. We have Justin Tucker. We are in the Windy City, as you can tell, Bear Stadium. So who knows if there's going to be, you know, wind. Um, or, you know, if I'm going to even be able to make it. But hopefully we are able to, you know, get an easy, nice kick. Or even get seven. You never know. It's right here. Easy dots. Got to get our feet in bounds, Calvin. And that's what we do. I'm definitely starting to love that route again. It's a route I used to run quite a bit. And, you know, what I want to start doing now is just start running more short side bunch. Because that's when I felt like I was really at a prime. Um, when I was just catching people off guard with some route combos. Because anyone could, you know, obviously adjust for double toes. Such a common meta play. Right here, we are going to run it. And, of course, right when I say that, we get 10 easy yards. What I want to do right here, guys, is audible over to tight. I don't think I could bomb him from this close. But we are going to be able to try to maybe hit this crossing route. I'm going to put Reggie Bush on a wheel route. I have 92 speed Reggie Bush. So if there's, like, the left side wide open, we are going to take this. It's right here. Um, bad user by K-Mac. And that's a dot. Could it be a touchdown? Yes, it is. Devin Hester. Thankfully, we all know Devin Hester always tries to sell on the sidelines right there. He did not. And you know what, guys? I think I'm going to go for two right here because I'm freestyling. I do get ball at half. We're just going to go for two. And I really do want to run this to Calvin. I'm really just looking for this hitch. But, you know, hopefully Galloway could, you know, catch this ball for us. It's right here. Um, high ball. And no, man, not the read at all. Please don't get go up for seven. And thankfully, we make a tackle. But I'm fine with that, man. We could always go for two out of half if we score. Um, you know, that kind of did halt some momentum our, on our part. But it is what it is. Really just don't want to give up a touchdown, honestly, man. I'm a little scared, though, because cover four. There's some crazy bombs have been going on, man. That's why I'm going to send five. I'm backing up everyone. We got the pressure. You know, that's inbounds. We'll take it. Oh, that's a little scary, though. Same defense again. Like I said, this isn't the best defense. But it is what it is. Broad moment. I don't know how he was able to complete that. Very bad user, but my zones just didn't go anywhere. Oh my god, how did he have enough time for that in the first place as well? And I don't even know who he threw that to, but somehow he's able to get three. It's just a tough scene out here. I should have probably run man or something, but I kind of was caught off guard. Someone was yelling downstairs. Guys, that's just a play I doubt ever happens in all Madden. Um, he just chucked it like 40, 50 yard crosser. At a deep path there, 20 yard purple, or excuse me, 20, 25 yard cloud. And he's still able to make the easiest read of his life. Not to mention, we did send five. Not mad at it though. We do get ball out of half. Just got to put one together, man. It's right here. Easy reads to uh, Darren Waller. Get tackled, unfortunately, but you know, it's all good. I'm stealing a route combo from Fancy right here. I do like this route combo. It's just an easy read. 
every single time it seems like and of course when I say that he is all over it but you know easy reads because the user is in quicksand in this game once more going back to a route combo that he hasn't really had success with so far um, I don't know man I had a touchdown right there I don't know if it was a touchdown obviously it didn't look like it but Calvin beat the press I just had to see what happened and unfortunately for me just way too much time um, but yeah man that definitely looks like it beats match really really well looking for Devin Hester on that out round that's what we get great rack animation don't get the first but you know it's not bad and guys I'm gonna go no quick cut quick hike with a easy flat read and man that that that's so cheese man double post is super cheese I'm gonna go to the same play again it's just such a tough play to just stop and unfortunately I can't put my right guy in the out route or whatever I wanted to put him on but that's easy reads again could Hester do it again and he's able to do it again <laughs> uh, nice crossing route dot he tried to send heat I think uh, his user was just in a super bad position and you know I, I've definitely messed up guys by going for two before half um, not getting it obviously now instead of being up you know 21 17 I'm only gonna be up 20 to 17 definitely not going for two right here but it, I do believe I will get ball last at least the way you know if I play proper defense I will get ball last so we're good so right here man I feel very comfortable in baseline pressing maybe not Roy Williams um, Roy Williams is a little scary but I do have Sean Taylor with that max speed there great defense all around the board Can Sean get there no he can't it's a baseline press quarter guys just goes to show on that all pro you can't expect anything to play anything he's gonna audible down again something that's been working out for him I don't know man I just can't really stop it it's right here we actually are able to stop it that's Calvin Megatron Johnson and we get absolutely cheated I can't believe he threw that I was very blind God dang really K Mac you throwing that I mean that definitely got me a little tilted man that was not the read at all just a blind read I'll say it it's just super blind read um, but you know, here we go, man. He's gonna make it just I don't know. He seems kind of flushed by the defense the past this past drive, but I can't believe it. If I'm using a wide receiver, how am I gonna get agged by another wide receiver? It just doesn't make any sense to me, guys. I mean, it's TGL for a reason, I guess. I mean, I don't know. I, I just don't know. It's right here. We're gonna send five. We don't get any pressure. Good low ball dot. Desmond Trufant try to get glitchy, but you know, I'm not gonna ask for too much. I really want to get a stop. We're selling out. And I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. And he caught it. He caught it. He, caught it. he is catching too much. I'm, guys, I'm going to make it last drive if he does get seven right here. You just got to assume that he goes for seven. Um, whether, you know, he even gets held to three or not. He's going to go for seven. Because the way this guy has been moving on offense, I kind of am just, just flabbergasted. Right there, he's going to run an easy touchdown. But we are going to make it last drive. We're not with the shenanigans anymore. I've been playing pretty much perfect to this point. Yeah, let's just walk out of here with a win, man. Hopefully we can make this last drive and, you know, stay undefeated and we can leave. Somehow I have disordered hot routes. I mean, I know why. It's a momentum feature. But did I get a first? It would be beautiful if that second in inches. And unfortunately we got a first. But, you know, it's all good because we could easily make this last drive. Just clock this game out. I believe he ran commit right there. Not a bad call. You know, he wants the ball last as well. Right here. This is actually pretty annoying. I don't know if you guys agree with me or not. The, the sword to hot routes could get super annoying. Um, you know, it's not a big thing because we all know what routes we're running and all that type of stuff. But it could definitely get annoying. It's right here. He actually played pretty good defense, and we're going to slide. Daniel Jones is such a bailout. I don't think he could do that with Stafford. Obviously, Vince Young and all that, you uh, don't have set feed lead. But, you know, Daniel Jones just kind of build this out right there. It'd rather be, you know, third and ten. It's now going to be a uh, third and four. And we're just trying to make easy reads right now, man. We have flood open. Can we stand bounds? No, we can't. But, you know, we're fine. Just move on to the next set of downs. Uh, maybe you should have rack caught that. But, you know, you don't want to cheat yourself, especially on a third down. Um, that 14 seconds, it's all good, you know. We're going to run the ball and take it to the two-minute warning. Maybe if we could get some yards on here, that would have been beautiful. But, you know get stuck on someone right here mesh post just looking for double drags and you know that's pretty good defense but once more daniel jones being a bailout third and one is amazing in this scenario third and inches i can always run the ball right here and you know if we get stuffed it is what it is um 
I think I'm gonna run the ball, man. Hopefully we are able to get this one yard, one inch. And it's right here. It's looking easy, and there it is. We're gonna bounce it out, but go down around the 25. I probably could've got a couple more yards, but I really don't wanna get stuck in the red zone um, or even clock myself out because it's so tough to be in the red zone. So we're just gonna keep playing this smart. We have plenty of time. We're gonna flip our bunch right here. We're gonna flip around 10 seconds, nine seconds, and we are just gonna call hike. He doesn't flip with us, so we have the numbers advantage to the right side. He's gonna obviously play hard slats. And boom, good catch. Stay in bounds. Beautiful, man. Very beautiful. Um, I am stuck in the red zone though, man. I really don't like the red zone in Colts playbook. It's kind of iffy compared to what I was running previously in Carolina. But you know, if we could drain these last two timeouts and get three around, when we, we saw what happened before half. So I'm a little scared, man. I'm a little scared, especially if he has, he does have goal line D. And man, going for two was super boneheaded by me. Um, I could be up going by a touchdown at this point. Or I mean, I could force him to get a touchdown if we score, obviously, at this point, rather than only going for, you know, three and tying it up. Obviously, though, first, we have to score. Here we are, down to the three. I really do want to run again, um, but I'm afraid I'm going to get back in the red zone, man. I'm afraid I am going to get back in the red zone. But, you know, if we score, we score. If we don't, we don't. It is what it is. It's just... It's just the get way the game is. You have to live with the you know, results of each play. We're gonna run right here. And that's honestly perfect. <laughs> if we can score, that is. That is gonna be perfect, man. We're gonna let this go all the way to around 10 seconds and we're gonna call our play. Guys, pray for me, man. It's, it's, I don't know what to do on the one yard line. Obviously I could go on goal line or something, but I feel like that's too, that's too just like obvious, you know. Oh man, to this point, I feel like I played it as perfect as I can. All we have to do is deliver a dot. If we can't, we lose. If we do, we win. Let's see what we got, man. I really could have went with a quick hike with double post, but I don't know, man. I really don't know. I just hope something is wide open. It's right here. He sends a heat, and he gets an acrobat. Oh, great game to K-Mac. That was too obvious. I just thought the pressure was gonna come in. R1 would have been open. GG's in the chat, man. It is what it is. We got a little bit unlucky, but it is what it is. 